Oh, okay, very, it's a big fish. Oh man, let's get him in. Is he still on? Oh, did you guys see that? He's just a really big bass. Yeah, nice fish, nice fish guys. Whoa, it's a really nice fish. Oh my gosh. Oh, it's a good one. <laughs> let's get this guy in. What a jerk, man. Smell a bear? Oh, I smell it too, dude. Oh, it's a nice fish. Let's get him on the shelf. Oh, he's a big one. He's big, guys. Guys, there's so many bass in here today. Could not ask for a better day to catch some smallmouth on the river. What's up guys, I'm super excited about today. Behind me we've got some woods and behind that we've got the Nolichucky River. We're going after smallmouth today guys. I'm gonna try something I've never done before. I've brought large toughies with me and we're gonna try a new setup today to see how they do. So guys, once we get down to the river, I'll show you my breakdown and then hopefully we'll catch a bunch of fish. Wish me luck, here we go. Have to be part mountain goat people. That's just part of it. If you guys haven't already noticed, I've got my buddy Ethan here. He's gonna be fly fishing today, pulling stuff out on the fly rod, which is epic. Oh, whereas I'm going for more of my traditional route here. I'm gonna try not to fall. It is very slippery here. That was a close one. With all this gear, I get nervous, guys. All right, guys, so quick breakdown for today. I'm using 12 pound monofilament. I'm also using Gamagatsu octopus hooks, and these are gonna be size one, okay? That's a good starting place for smaller baits. I'm also using some small um, split shot as well. And then, of course, a balsa wood float or bobber. And that's pretty much it. So let's get out here. Let's see what we can do. Uh-oh. <laughs> some more people got dumped. That's a tough spot. A lot, of, a lot of people have been getting flipped today. Whoa, I just saw a ton of bait fish right there. That was crazy little darters all right guys let's walk on down here and start actually fishing here we go oh fish there we go guys fish fish on guys here we go whoa yes sir all right first fish of the day smallmouth check it out you guys first bass smallmouth let's go ahead and toss him back even with all the rafters he was biting so that's a good sign all right guys let's pitch it right back in let's see if we can get another one i'm just gonna go to that straight up to that same spot and guys that first bass he bit within about i don't know maybe the first minute of it being in the water so it didn't take long at all oh there he goes oh oh i missed it you guys the bass are in there thick i've got to move the bait tank a little bit closer let me go grab it real quick guys all right guys this is a perfect little spot right here my bait tank will not go anywhere. Whoa. Woo. Check it out, guys. This is crazy. Man, what an adventure today, guys. We've got rafters on one side, a train on the other, and we've got smallmouth biting right here. Cast number three, two bobbers down, one fish caught. What a jerk, man. So guys, I don't know if you saw that. That guy just smacked the water on purpose to try to mess up any fish that may be catching. So what'd you get? Smalley? Yeah. Awesome, dude. What is How big is he? Uh, nice, man. All right, so Ethan's on the board. He's got a nice little small mouth. Let's get back over there, see what we can do. Everything was cool until like one of the guides over there took his paddle and smacked as hard as he could in the water right next to me to try to scare the fish away. Yeah, I got it on film. Yeah, yeah, he kind of like giggled to everybody and then they kept going. So guys, all those rafters, they're finally gone. They were making a ton of noise. I honestly didn't really care because they were having such a good time until that one guy smacked his paddle in the water to try to scare away all the fish. Then all of a sudden I wasn't getting bites and uh, I know he did it on purpose. He even laughed everybody in his boat. So um, that was messed up. Hopefully the bite turns back on. We'll see. I'm gonna get back down there. Let's get back to it I know there's plenty more fish out here, so I'm not too worried about it It's just always a little bit frustrating when someone does something on purpose to Try to make you sure you don't catch a fish 
There he goes. He's got him. Oh, pulled it right out of his mouth. Let's check. Is he still on? Oh, did you guys see that? Let's check. Is he still on? Oh. Got him. Oh my gosh. Guys, that was crazy. Let's get him up. Woo. <laughs> yeah. Guys, I was reeling in when he shot by, so I just let it stop. And then he came up and grabbed it. That was insanity. All right, guys. There's another beautiful bass. Look at that beauty. Heck yeah. Go ahead and just toss him right back in here. There he goes. Let's get another one on, guys. The bite's on right now. So, guys, I'm using a medium fast rod made by, it's actually a custom built rod by Brahmas Bait and Tackle. Um, I'm a fan of college football, so I had um, a Tennessee rod made for me, um, but they do custom rods for anybody. It's just super, super cool. Let's get this back out here. Let's catch another one. Well, uh, whoa. Oh my goodness, guys. Fish on. Dude, this spot's just absolutely insane. The amount of bass in here is absolutely awesome. Here's another smallmouth, you guys. All right, guys, back into the pool again. This seems to be a pretty nice little hot spot right here. We got a lot of feeding water all around, and it all swirls right here where there seems to be a lot of bass. I'm very curious to see if we get a big fish. Come up, there it is. He's on it. Got him, fish on. Ooh. Oh, fish off, fish off. Let's pitch it right back over there, see if we got any friends. Oh my goodness. Guys, this is so much fun. Oh my gosh, it's already gone. Got him. Woo! Oh. Guys, there's so many bass in here today. Oh, this is epic. Let's pitch him right back. Guys, I haven't caught anything huge yet, but man, the action is uh, second to none right now. This is incredible. Every time I hook set, the bobber slides up the line a little bit. You got to get it down in front of their eyeballs. So let's pitch it back out again. Same spot, but this time deep enough that they see it. My goal is to get it two thirds of the way down in that water column. Oh, there we go. Fish on. Oh, had a fish on. He sped it, guys. There he goes. He's got it. You got him. Fish on, guys. Here we go. Heck yeah. He's fighting really good. Wow. Oh, and there's more chasing him, guys. Another beautiful bass, you guys, right here. And he got his buddies fired up. I saw others chasing him that time, guys. Well, the bite's on fire right here. Oh, yeah. Here we go, guys. Another fish on. Fish on. Here we go. Woo. Here we go. Another river smolly, guys. These things just fight like crazy. Check him out. There he is. <laughs> Let's go ahead and pitch him back. Ethan's about to rip one out with the fly rod, which is going to be epic. Oh, there he goes. Fish on. Fish on. Here we go. Oh, yeah, that one feels good. Oh, my gosh. What a spot, man. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's probably my best one of the day. Holy smokes, man. They all fight, though, like crazy. All right, guys, yet again, another beauty. We can give this guy a good release. We'll do it right here. And he's off. All right, guys, so literally, I was releasing my fish. Ethan goes, fish on. Boom. River smallmouth on the fly rod. That's legit. I'm not going to tell you what he was using. You can uh, you can find him on his Instagram. <laughs> One, two, three. Heck yeah. Ah, oh, I saw that. Heck yeah, Ethan's on. <laughs> yeah! Dude, every time he hooks on the fly rod, that is just so cool, guys. What a cool spot, man. In the net. Well done, sir. Oh, fish, fish on. Ethan's getting his out. <laughs> We're pulling in another one. Yeah. All right, Ethan's is gone. I'm gonna release mine as well. Woo, this is crazy. Well, I'm glad I got two dozen of these things because pretty much every single one's a fish. Guys, the water is not actually running super clear. It's a little bit silty. That's exactly what we want because it makes it even easier to get close to these fish. Oh, there you go. Uh, oh yep. Fish on. Whoa, yeah. 
You know what? I totally moved him and when I stopped, he hit and then you were like, there you go. Oh, are you serious? Yeah. Oh, they're fired up. Here goes another one right here. Let's get pitching back. Okay, this is a fun spot. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> this is a fun spot. Okay. Guys, Ethan just hooked into one that like smoked him out there about 20 feet out. Uh, hey, I got you, I got you. Yeah, you just fight. Oh man. Oh yeah. <laughs> Here he comes. Whoa! Yeah! Dude, nice one. Check that out, you guys. Again, ask Ethan on his Instagram if you really want to know. <laughs> not not telling, not telling. Dude, that was so cool. Oh! He, look, he, there he is, there he is. Got him! I got you that time. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Woo. Got him, guys. Check out that little guy. Go ahead and toss him back. Guys, we are getting ready to go ahead and give up for the day when all of a sudden Ethan goes fish on. So there's his indicator there, guys. So we're very close, but he's fighting it. Tooth and nail, as all these river smallies do. Oh, what a beauty. Yeah. Dude, beautiful fish. I don't I don't have a fresh teffy on. I don't know what you're talking about. I'm not pumped to catch one more. Not me. I guarantee you, if you hadn't have hooked that one though, we're already up there though. <laughs> Hey, got him! Woo! Finally! There he goes. <laughs> are you gonna cast anymore or are you calling it? Whoa! Oh, fish on! Fish on! Oh, nice fish! Whoa! I swear that's my big bass! <laughs> Whoa! Dude, he's fighting like crazy! Look at that! Heck yeah, guys! What a beauty, man. Whew. All right, guys, I've had a blast today. Me and Ethan have just pulled out a ton of smallmouth. We've had a great bite today, but um, it's time to go. The weather's kind of getting ready to change. It's about to rain. Uh, so we're gonna head back to the cars. What's up, guys? We're back here for day two. We fished last night. We had so much fun, we decided to come back and do it again. Let's get after it. Let's see what we can get. Oh, no way. He's already on, guys. I haven't even, it's a big one. Guys, I don't even, I haven't even had a chance to get a bait on. Ethan's already on. Let's go. Man, what a start. Dude, nice fish. Got him, yes. Whoa. Dude, look at the pattern on that one. On the hand tied one, boys. Oh, Ethan ties his own flies, guys, and he was able to catch one on that. And I think you tied that today, didn't you? Yeah. <laughs> Dude, that's so cool. That's a beautiful smallie. Good deal, man. Hey, way to go. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, dude, we, how long was that fly in the water? 30 seconds, maybe? Yeah, maybe. Maybe. All right, this is my smallest bait. We're gonna get this one out of the way real quick. See if somebody hits them. Hopefully they do. Oh, fish on. Holy smokes. Yeah, they're still here. Wow. Woo. All right, dude, unbelievable, <laughs> unbelievable. Oh, there he goes, fish on, Woo. oh my gosh, the bite is on today. <laughs> Wow. Guys, that was maybe in the water for 10 seconds that time. So fast. Let me get the camera back up. Oh no, he's in the little pool. Ow. Oh, there he is. What? What? <laughs> Whoa. He's underneath you. No, 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 no. I think he wedged himself. He did. He's, he's right there. He's like, don't eat me. <laughs> he's just perfectly wedged his head. <laughs> All right, all right, just, just go, <laughs> just go. <laughs> Good night. 
Oh, there he goes. Got him. Whoa. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Dude, they're all fun, man. Another beauty. Oh yeah, got one. Got him. Oh yeah. Woo! All right guys, let's go ahead and just pitch him back in. I'll wait for a bigger one. Whoa! <laughs> he tried to go that way, had to turn around and then go back down. Yeah. Oh, we got one. Got him. That was subtle, wow. Yeah, it does. He's not bad at all. We'll pull him up. Yeah. Oh, pitch on. Woo. Need, do you need assistance? Yeah. Ethan's got one, guys. Oh, yeah, that's nice. Go ahead. Yeah. Well done. Yeah, he, uh, mine's on. Got him. Woo. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Another beautiful smallmouth, guys. Could not ask for a better day to catch some smallmouth on the river. There's another beauty, let's pitch him. There he goes, I'm gonna wait a second. Oh no. Yeah. Ah, everything. Hopefully he comes back up in a little while. Sometimes they do. Dang it. Oh, there it is, there it is. That's the bass right there. If he comes close enough, I'm gonna try to um, try to get him. I just rigged up to try to catch it. There we go, there we go. Uh, yeah, I got it. I got it. There's no fish, but I got my rig back. Yes. All right, <laughs> trash out of the river. <laughs> Good. So guys, that bass got free and uh, I was able to get my whole rig back. So that was pretty cool. There we go. Yeah. Somebody's slowly taking them under. Got him. Yep. Fish on guys. Heck yeah. Quick look. Let's go ahead and give him a little toss here in the foam. All right. Oh. Got him. That feels pretty good. He's not coming up at all. Wow. Hello. Oh, wow. Yeah, he's not bad. That's that's the biggest one. Yeah. Stay on. Man. I, I think I got it. He's just a really big bass. Yeah. Oh, the, there it is, guys. Oh, that's the big one that I've been after. Oh, man, guys. So we've been just working our way through these little guys. Finally caught a big boy. All right, guys, that one was huge. That was a lot of fun to fight. I knew it was gonna be a big one when I couldn't quite get him up to see him. Um, so that was definitely, I was wondering if I was gonna catch a big one. I finally did, so the Nola Chuck, yeah, holds some big ones, guys. You just kinda have to weed through some of the smaller fish. We're gonna keep at it, see what else we can do. Let's see what happens. Oh, there he is, there he is. Got him. Fish on, guys. Out there in that foam. Oh yeah, another another nice one actually. Dude, that's probably my second best uh, fish of the day. All right guys, so me and Ethan both noticed this, but there's actually a pretty big battery right behind us. I hate to leave a battery out in nature. It's not a good place for us. So we're gonna actually, I'm gonna go ahead and put it in one of my tackle box little sleeves there so that it doesn't uh, contaminate nature and we're gonna get it out of here. Okay, yeah, that's not great. Go ahead and get that back home, thrown away. 
All right, guys, so we fished this hole for two days in a row. We know there's more stuff out here. We've just been having so much fun catching it, but behind us is a really good pool. And then in front of us, we're gonna hike a little ways and see what else we can find. So let's get going, let's see what else we can do. Guys, this river and this gorge are just like, it's an incredibly beautiful place. Though if I'm correct, I believe it's also called the River of Death. <laughs> Something like that because, guys, it does not have any kind of man-made dam to control the water. When it rains, it sometimes floods here. And guys, when I say flood, I mean it can get up high. So, yeah, yeah, no, you're good. What's that? Smell a bear? Hmm. Oh, I smell it too, dude. Is that is that scat? Is that like bear scat? Man, that is a potent smell, man. I wonder if one's up in a tree somewhere. Yeah, I still smell it. Some good looking water, man. Oh, look at this section, guys. Wow. Let's get out here and catch something. But I'm gonna go up a little bit higher. I see some softer water. So I'll be right up here. So guys, this is all brand new water to me. I've never fished it. Oh, wow. This is, I mean, this is some pretty phenomenal water. We'll go ahead and fish this section for sure. All right, guys, so we're gonna put our, our toughies in this fresh water right here. Just pitch it out, make sure it's laying on its open side down. And then I'm just gonna take this uh, piece of metal and I'm just gonna stick it right into the sand right there so it can't go anywhere. All right, guys, here we go. Let's pitch it right off of that uh, sweeping water. Oh, Ethan's got one. Heck yeah. <laughs> That's a good sign. Oh, I just got a hit. Yeah. Oh, I had one, guys. Man, this river is unbelievably fun to fish, guys. The Nola Chucky Gorge is just so underrated. I just had no idea it was this fun to fish. Let's pitch it right back out there into that kill zone. All right, next time it goes under, I'm gonna let it take it for a second, and I'm gonna set the hook a lot harder. Yep, there he goes. Oh, okay, very, it's a big fish. Oh my gosh. Woo. Oh, it's a big fish. Oh man, let's get him in. Oh, oh what a fight. Yeah, really nice fish, guys. Let's get him up. Heck yeah. Oh man, what a fish, guys. That was a great, great quick strike. Beauty, look at that, you guys. <laughs> He's so meaty and chunky. He's definitely got a bit of a belly on him. And man, do these rivers smallmouth, they fight so hard. When I hook set into that, it felt like I hooked set into a log to start moving. Let's go ahead and give a nice release right here. <laughs> oh my gosh, this is too much fun. All right, let's pitch it back out here. See if we can get another one. I think we can. It seems like that spot right over there is really good. Though again, I've just got that bell wide open. As soon as that bobber shoots under, it's on. Ooh, fish on, whoa, nice fish, nice fish guys, whoa, it's a really nice fish, oh my gosh, oh it's a good one, <laughs> let's get this guy in, oh wow, this is definitely the nicest fish of the day for me, oh wow, oh my goodness guys, he's a monster, oh, no way, no way, no way. Oh my gosh, that one's approaching 20 inches. Oh, he's big. <laughs> Look at this smallmouth. Oh my gosh. <laughs> what a monster. Yes. All right, guys, let's give this bass a release. Whoa. And he's off. Man, guys, I am in shock right now. The last two fish out of this new pool have just been monsters. And, uh, I'm telling you, the fight is just absolutely insane. So, man, I cannot wait. Let's get another one out there quick and see what else we can catch. All right, guys. So, I see a really nice deep cut that runs right across here, and the water is much slower. And uh, I love it. I think we're going to pull something out right here. Oh, oh, oh. Fish on. Yep, that's a fish. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, so in that cut, guys, there really was a smallmouth hanging out. So guys, right there, 10 feet from me in that little chute, there was a little guy hanging out. That was super cool. Let's give him a little release. Whew. Through my legs, that was cool. 
All right, here we go, guys. Another one out. Ooh. I think he already got hit. Ooh. Oh, fish on. Yeah. Another one in that cut. Oh my gosh. A lot bigger too, guys. Oh, it's a nice fish. Let's get him on the shelf. Oh, oh, he's a big one. He's big, guys. Oh my gosh. Oh, let's get him in. Let's see if I can lip him. Oh, he's a nice fish, guys. He's one of the nicest ones of the day yet again. Oh, get my hand in there. Got him. Yes. <laughs> Look at that bass, you guys. This is absolutely on fire today. That's another quality fish, you guys. I, I cannot believe it. This is the best day I've ever had on the Nolichucky. Guys, look at that beautiful fish. Unbelievable. This day, man, just incredible. Yeah! He caught a huge creek chub, you guys. <laughs> yes! So guys, we're back in this cut yet again. We're right in it right now. They seem to be hitting right over here, so let's see what happens. Yep, there it goes again. We had a fish on for a second, guys. He got him. Got him, fish on. There is a school of bass right in front of me, and man, are they hungry. All right, guys, yet again, another beautiful little bass. Let's go ahead and release him right here, and away he goes. Really? Let's go. Yeah, it is. Yeah! <laughs> Ethan with the bass. So guys, I, I told him there's a cut right here where I've caught mine. He, I mean, first cast, dude. <laughs> that was incredible. See if I can get in on this action. Oh, mine's gone. Fish on. Whoa. <laughs> Heck yeah. Dude, I was watching you and I looked back and the bobber was gone. Here we go, guys. Another bass off of this little cut. It's a good little spot. It's a spot down here that I really want to do. We're going to hike down just to see what kind of nice calm pocket we've got down here it's super pancakey it's deep we see a little path so we're going down i've got to let them i gotta let them go out a little bit deeper and fall more though i think and then pull them up from the depths there we go this is gonna be fun now i just put my finger on this line make sure he doesn't get smoked on his fall he did he did fish on on the drop Guys, look at that. Gulp minnow, second cast. <laughs> Caught a nice little smallie while he was falling. I didn't even start reeling yet. I just noticed the line getting tight. Oh, shoot. Okay. <laughs> he's good. He's good. Somehow he got down there. That was impressive. All right, guys. Well, it's getting late. I actually switched over to a uh, small gulp minnow. Ended up catching one more bass, which is super fun. But it's time to get out of here. So, guys, we're going to call it a day. If you'd like to see more Nolichucky videos, I've got a couple of really fun ones. One where I flip over rocks and find some grampus. Or you may be interested in another video of me and Ethan where we go up into the mountains and find beautiful brook trout. That's another good one. So, guys, till next time, tight lines. Three, two, one.